Hi everyone, this is Sangeeta Bhaktian and today I'm going to be making a panini sandwich with uh, it's, it's a very very simple sandwich. It has uh, ciabatta bread uh, and um, heirloom tomatoes and uh, mozzarella cheese and uh, basil. So what I'm going to do is first I'm going to be adding just a little bit of butter on both sides. Just a tad bit and I'm going to be adding butter on the panini maker as well. And this panini maker, uh, maker has uh, those removable inserts so it's easy to clean. What I'm going to be doing here is adding the cheese first and then tomatoes <clears throat> and a couple of three basil leaves actually not a couple some salt and some oregano Dried oregano. You can omit dried oregano if you don't want it. That's fine. And some fresh black pepper. I'm going to add the salt to this here. And that goes there. I'm going to assemble one more. Cheese. Cheese. Tomato, maybe one more slice of tomato, basil, oregano, pepper, and some salt. Uh, you can add olive oil too if you want to um, not add butter, that's fine here be careful with your fingers you don't want that you don't want to damage your fingers press it really hard so that you get the grill marks and let it hang out there for about a couple of minutes before you do anything to it i'm going to be applying uh some more butter on top just to, so that the top part becomes oops nice and crusty and you get those beautiful grill marks It'll hang out for another couple of minutes and uh, we'll be good to go. So the panini is done. You can see it's nicely toasted. Get it out another time. You can see the ooey gooey cheese there. It's nice and melty. I'm going to do this. stabilize this. really really hot gotta be careful there okay I'll cut it Ooh, look at that there it is um tomato basil and mozzarella panini so um i've made a uh, tomato basil soup earlier on and i'm going to be serving that with uh the soup so that is that and that is that Thank you so much for watching the making of uh, tomato, basil, and mozzarella panini. Um, I hope you like it and I also hope that you will try making it because it's super simple and um, you can literally put it together in under five minutes. Please like, subscribe, and share and comment down below what you would like me to make next. Thank you.